Okay, folks. Here's what we've got. The bees came in. Actually, the uh, the post office gave me a call and said, "Hey, you need to come down here and get these bees." <laughs> I don't think our postman or woman uh, wanted to deliver them, so uh, had to go get them over at lunch. And we came in here. There's some dead ones down on the bottom, but. There's a good little chunk still in there. Now, I don't know what the deal is, but for some reason, uh, these guys have been, and it's probably this, this comb that I've put in, in here, is attracting other bees, and they're one to go ahead and fill it up. So I got the sugar water in. I need to get her out and put her in the hive somehow and I've got uh, just gonna get a little smoke around here and I'm also going to uh, spray them down with some sugar water so let's start out just regular old sugar water here so you guys can see that got the smoke rolling will calm them down a little bit but we're gonna just really really coat their feathers, their wings, <laughs> their feathers. Thinking of my chickens. Let's just coat them all with a lot of a lot of uh, sugar water here. And they'll get it off. They'll clean off. It shouldn't hurt them at all. get them out off the I'm gonna open this up a little bit more and hopefully let me see if I can get her out of there without wind going the other way. this up top here the main thing is they're gonna go all right they're gonna go wherever she goes I think they definitely are swarmed around her so Bunch of them. And this is not as easy as they stapled for a little. Here it comes. There we go. Okay. Again. She doesn't all drop her. And what I'm going to do is slide this cover back over. I only lost a few there. Okay. So she is. She is in there. And actually, I don't know if you can see her or not she's got a big tail longer tail than the others so how is she gonna get out of there i think oh we need to pull her so they can see her what i'd like to do I 
think it's going to stay. So they should be able to see her. And this will work. I'm going to spray these guys. Some more sugar water. And kind of let you see where she's at. She's in here, right there in her little cage. We're gonna leave her in there for a little while. And we're gonna get, we're gonna dump all these bees right in there. And they should stay with her. So let's see how it goes. Calm them down a little bit. And then I'm gonna put the lid on top of it. So. All right, there we go. Got a thick of them piled in there. They are angry ish, but they are in there. They're all in there now with her probably going to do is I'm going to leave this somewhat close to the door opening so if they come out let me make sure some sugar water yep, has dropped in there that should be it now I think what we'll do in a couple days is we will uh let her out of the cage i think there's going to be there's a little cork in there <clears throat> so we need to let her out of her little screen cage in a couple days i went ahead and i don't know if i should have but i'm hoping that you can kind of see this entrance let me get a little closer i left the entrance open might not have been the best idea maybe it was but I left it open because uh, I didn't know if it was going to get too hot. But if she's in the cage and they accept her, then they should stay. So I think we're just going to leave them be for right now. <laughs> like the pun, leave, leave them be. And uh, just kind of let them get settled in to their new home. All right, stay tuned. I'll give you guys a little more updates as they come.